mischievous magicians who love to mess with people. So tonight, they are going to teach you a trick that will help you mess with your friends. For more, here are Penn and Teller. Right. Here's a trick that you can do at home. Hope you got your DVRs running, because we'll give you the punchline at the end. All you need is a deck of cards, the punchline will give you, and a friend. I'll play the part of you, Teller will be my friend. Hey, friend, want to see a card trick? Why don't you pick a number between one and ten? Seven. What I want you to do is take the deck when my back is turned, count down seven cards. One, two, three, four, five, six. Look at that seventh card and remember it. Can you do that right? Okay, I'm going to turn my back, count down seven cards, look at the card, but don't let me see it. You're counting them down? Look at that card and memorize it. You got it clear in your head? Now put it anywhere you want in the deck. And put those other cards on top and give them a shuffle if you want. Now you watch these magic hands. I just take the deck, tap it once, and your card appears right on the top. Was your card the eight of clubs? <laughs> it, it wasn't? Well, I, I guess I'm a failure, my friend. I'll never be as good as you are. I couldn't find the card at all. Well, let's do something else fun, okay? Let's watch Jane the Virgin. I'm sure Jane said nice things, but I'm still rattled, so I can't pretend to be touched right now. Do you think Chuck did it? I don't know. But is this your card? See? See? I did the trick right. See? See? I'm the winner! And we got our friends at Jane the Virgin to make that video for you. And you'll record it right here on your, uh, on your DVR. Then all you've got to do is have a deck of cards with the three of clubs on top. And you'll do what's called a card force. Now you ask your friend to name a number between one and ten. He names six. Now the card you want, the three of clubs, is already on top. But I demonstrate how to count to six. One. Two, three, four, five, and look at this card six. What I've done is put the three of clubs six down in the deck. It's now the sixth card. The force is complete. I now turn my back and ask him to count down six cards. I know he's going to pick the three of clubs. He looks at that card, he's got the three of clubs. Tell him to put it anywhere in the deck. You don't care where he puts it, put the other cards on top. Have him shuffle until the proverbial cows come home, even if he doesn't shuffle well. Then take him like this, then you do one tap and get the wrong card. Seven of hearts, is that your card? <laughs> Let him gloat. He who laughs last, laughs best. Now, change the subject kind of nonchalantly. Well, I'm a failure. Let's do something else fun. Instead of just turning on the TV, you play the DVR with the clip that we're going to give you right now. Here's where you start playing it for your friend. Go. I'm sure Jane said nice things, but I'm still rattled, so I can't pretend to be touched right now. Do you think Chuck did it? I don't know. But is this your card? Ha ha ha! When that's over, it's your turn to gloat. Go, 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 go. You fool, you fool, you fool. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Fool, 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 fool. Gotcha. 